In this video, I went on Roblox and coded jailbreak so that the car radio would get completely revamped and look a whole lot cooler. Also, only a small percentage of people that watch my videos are actually subscribed to the channel. So if you like the video or even want to see more, consider subscribing because honestly, it's free and you can always change your mind later. If you want to see your idea coded into your favorite game, leave a like and comment down below on what you want to see next. Anyways, enjoy the video. All right, hey guys, it's me, the official Roblox account. Now, nah, you guys know I'm joking. So, this is Jailbreak, like you saw in the title. Uh, but to get to the point where we can use the new car radio, we have to escape first. That's the whole point of Jailbreak, so we gotta do that. I'm gonna check if these have anything in them, because typically they do, uh, but they probably don't this time. Nope, nothing in them. So we're gonna go ahead and set out on our journey to escape. So there's uh, a couple of ways to escape. I'm going to see if I can try to get a key card first, just so I could get to a lot of other vehicles a lot easier. Uh, because the car radio does not only work with cars, it works with any type of vehicle in the game. So uh, helicopters, cars, etc. So we're going to go ahead and blow up this wall. It doesn't seem like anyone is paying attention. So we're just going to wait here and try to explode this wall. Get past, get a car maybe. You know, listen to some good old jams on the car radio. And uh, nobody else is paying attention. It seems like that person's going to try to come for us. I don't know. Oh, okay. I missed it. <laughs> Uh, I tried to do something and I missed uh, when it blew up, exploding the wall. So, all right, there we go. Let's go through. We're out. So now you just got to go get a car. There's usually a car on the other side over here. Could also go through the sewers, I guess. Uh, but that's not really on my agenda here. There's a car right here that someone left for us. And uh, there we go. All right, so now that we found a car right here, there's a cop over there. I don't know if he's going to come for me or not. Yeah, I don't know. I think he's just jamming. He's vibing. So uh, now that we have a car, what happens when I get in is going to be pretty sick. Uh, it doesn't change a whole lot. It changes something. So let's go get ahead and get right into the whole uh, driving aspect in the car radio. So I go ahead and get in. And as you already notice, there is music playing. There's a car radio. All your items are no longer visible. Uh, we're going to have to try to get a way out of here, though. As you can see, we have our nitrous or our nitro boost down there. We could still see that and we could still click on it and it still brings up everything. So you can use it just like normal. So uh, I don't know. I'm going to see if I could get away from the cars. Someone is going to try to come my way. So I'm just going to try to do the good old flip on them, you know? See, there they come. See, there they are. And uh, they with the Cybertruck skin, that person's going. So it seems like every, all the cops are vibing right now, which is pretty good. Uh, so we're just going to go ahead and use some Nitro. As you can see, we're using it down there. Okay, well, I didn't beat to do that. So I'm going to try to just get over to the city, maybe get somewhere nice so we get to get a nice view uh, for the most part. Because, you know, when you've got the radio playing in the background, you want to be able to go ahead and vibe with that soundtrack playing in the background and just go and see some nice views. That's all about the, that's what the radio is. And that's what it's for. That's why people made the radio so people can vibe with the tunes they want to hear. So anyways. Uh, I'm just gonna try to get somewhere nice. I really like how they made this update where the map is really complete Really nice and beautiful looking, but we're gonna try to get a nice view somewhere in the map uh, There are specific places that I know where we could get this type of view So I'm just gonna go ahead and try to get that view somewhere. All right, so we're gonna just try and go through the city and Find somewhere where we won't be interrupted. I went a little bit too far. So we're gonna have to 180 this and uh, actually, we could probably cut over here using the nitro, the nitrous. Again, we'll just go right over and then we'll change it. So you might have heard then the background, the music actually changed. So just like a radio station, it will shift through all the soundtracks that you have. And I just went in a loop. I can't believe this. I literally went in a loop. Are you kidding me? Oh, and I can't even knock that over. That's unbelievable. Okay. So yeah, as you notice, the tracks will go uh, will go around and they will just keep replaying on the same station. And I will be showing you guys something pretty fantastic. You can't do this at Jailbreak. I coded Jailbreak so it could do this. 
and I think it's a huge improvement over what they have right now. So, and personally, I think it makes the game a lot more fun to play, especially when it's customized to your taste. So we're going to try to get over there. We're just going to try to climb up this mountain. So we're going to try to do that. And I'm going to take the right turn here. Going to do a cool drift. Uh, okay, not as cool as I thought it was going to be, uh, but still pretty sick. So we're just going to go over and uh, we're going to drift up the mountain here. And man, uh, drifting a jailbreak can be kind of bad. Okay, so we had to use a little bit of nitro there. So you could always go and buy nitro when you want, uh, whenever. So we're going to go up this way just because the other way is uh, not as cool because you don't get to go up as high as anything else. So we're going to try doing that. All right. Whoa, 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 okay. Anyways, so this is a beautiful view, nice little cave. It's one of my favorite places uh, in Jailbreak because you just get a really nice view. So like I said, this radio works with any vehicle in the game. It works with aircraft, it works for every single car in the game, Jeep, whatever you could think of, it works, even with the UFO. Uh, so let me go ahead and show you what this looks like when you're in the car. You probably already seen it because I was driving around, you were able to hear the music, but let's go in a little bit more in depth and I'll show you what I coded Jailbreak to do. So when you get in the driver's seat, the radio picks up where you left off. So I'll get out of it right now and you, it'll get in and set this, you know, certain part of the lyric and then I'll go back in. And as you can see, the music starts where it ended. So this happens even if you leave the game, it picks up where you left off. It's a really nice feature. So if we go back into the radio, and we'll see that we're currently on the radio station Spooks FM and the song playing is Dance Monkey. Now we're doing some song, I can't really read the part, Yutsu and Sun. So that's the current song that's playing. So what happens if I go ahead and pause it? Well, I pause it, it stops playing. I can exit the vehicle, go back in, and as you could hear, no music is playing. And when we open it back up, Bam, it's still paused. And uh, you can move on to the next station and it'll just reset uh, once you do that. So uh, that's how this station switching will work with one song. And if you delete that station, it'll just say there's no stations and you'd have to add one. I wanna show you uh, how you can edit these. So if you press the edit button here, you'll be able to see that there's the name here which we could change. So like, let's say we want it to be called AM, right? So I could press finish and bam, it's changed, Spooks AM. Uh, I could also edit it again. I'm gonna change it back to Spooks FM because AM doesn't make that much sense, kind of. So as you can see here, we have a bunch of songs. So I can delete any of these songs when I want. So let's say I wanna get rid of the first song in here. So I just press delete and bam, it's gone. And then I can press finish and now it's onto Dance Monkey. So it completely got rid of it. So how do you view all the stations you have? Cause what if you just don't wanna click on those buttons and change the station to edit one of your already existing radio stations? Well, that's perfectly fine because that is what this button down here is for. This button down here will allow you to view every single station you have. So right now we only have this one station, but we could pause the station from here. Uh, if it was a station that wasn't playing, we could uh, start the station from here as well. We can edit the station. I'm just gonna press finish and it goes back to where it was and it just goes back to playing because we just edited it. So we don't know whether or not we should play it or not. You could also delete stations from here as well if you want to. How can you add a station? How can you create a new station with new songs? How do you add one in? Well, that's very simple because there is a plus icon down here just for that where you could create a station. So I'm gonna go ahead and create a station with elevator music. So we're just gonna call this uh, elevator, uh, I don't know, elevator.fm. Sure, let's do that. And I'll go ahead and copy the sound ID here. And now click add song, paste the sound ID, and after I've done that, I've added a new song. And now I can press finish and create a station. All right, so now that we've created that new station, what if we want to go ahead and play that? Well, we could simply just go ahead and click on this arrow and go to the next station and then click on it to go back. Or we could just go like this and that. So there's a bunch of different ways to play different stations, especially when you could just go to the station list and you could go ahead and see all your stations here. 
and then you could just press the play button on elevator.fm and it starts playing that station and I could switch back just by pressing the play button here. So it's a really powerful kind of radio station I added into Jailbreak and I can go ahead and delete this at any time. So let's say I just want to go ahead and delete it now. Now we're going back to Spooks FM and it's playing automatically and we could go ahead and click this and it does nothing. So it's very, very helpful tool um, and it works really well. So you can add in any song you want and you can just drive around to your heart's content because you know why not you have a radio station in jailbreak that's pretty cool now how does this work when uh you switch teams because as you can see it's the same color as everything else so what does it look like if you switch teams well let's go ahead and do that all right so here we are i'm now a police officer and uh we need to go get a car because we need to go get that radio station it basically won't matter if you're a cop, prisoner, or criminal because uh, everything will start off as it was the last time you played the radio. So, oh perfect, there's a helicopter so it's a good time to show off the helicopter and how that looks. So if I get into the helicopter, as you can see, the button and all the other colors have changed to fit your team color just like the rest of the buttons in Geobreak. And so I could just go ahead and go and uh, everything works the same way it worked. I can go ahead and pause it whenever I want and I can do a bunch of other stuff. So like I said, doesn't matter the vehicle, it just works. So yeah, that is the brand new radio that I coded into Jailbreak. I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, I spent about a day working on this and I think it turned out really, really good. Uh, Jailbreak developers, if you end up watching this, call me, I'm always available. And uh, if you guys want to see your favorite game, have your idea coded into it, go ahead, subscribe, leave a comment down below, tell me what you want to see next, leave a like if you enjoy the video and want to see more videos like this, and uh, that's about it. So thank you guys for watching. Uh, there will be these square things at the end of the video that you can click to see my other videos if you want to learn how to do stuff like this. And that's about it. Thank you guys for watching this video. I really enjoyed making it. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.